morning. Um, today I'm going to talk about relationships because January is notoriously known for the month of separations and couples coming in to see therapists and lawyers getting busy. And I think there's probably a couple of reasons for that. Is first of all, a lot of people take their leave in December, so they're spending a lot of time together. Secondly, family issues might come up because there's many celebrations. And thirdly, I think burnout as well because of the end of the year. And I think I always say to people, do not make a decision to get divorced or separated in January. Let's rather just see what we can do and get some clarity on the way forward. Rather exit with peace of mind.